Hello, welcome to our video. In this video, we will describe how to use the signal events placed on the boundary of an activity. We will begin by building our basic process model for cargo loading operations. Our happy day process consists of loading cargo and transferring the cargo to the crew. However, what would happen if we observed a lightning strike during loading? An exception in our process is created based on this event. Here is a good example for using signal events. This is because signal events can be used for general system notifications. Signal events are used when there is no specific target but a general notification is sent for anyone to see. An event such as a lightning strike doesn't have a specific targeted audience. So, using the signal boundary event placed on the activity load cargo enables us to create a new exception flow into a new activity. In this case, we indicate that in the event of a lightning strike, we evacuate the loading zone. Upon evacuating the loading zone, our process ends. Thank you again for joining us for this short introduction to intermediate signal events placed on the boundary of an activity. If you enjoyed this video, please take a moment to hit the like button. If you are interested in learning more about BPMN and how you can apply BPMN to your organization's business process models, please subscribe to our channel as we routinely create new videos.